Good morning, evening, afternoon, everybody. Whatever time it is in your area. The votes are in. And unanimously, by a long, by a long margin, Waffle House won. So, um, the next, after Waffle House, I'm going to do um, the Cracker Barrel. So, without further ado, again, thank you for your support, your comments, and all your votes. Without further ado, Waffle House All Star Breakfast. I hope you enjoy it. Thanks again. Well, good morning, evening, afternoon, everybody, whatever time it is in your area. Today's video is going to be another food review, restaurant review. Uh, this one is uh, from Waffle House, and it's the all-star breakfast. We decided to have uh, breakfast for dinner the other night. And it's going to be a voiceover, um, sitting down in a restaurant. Um, won't be able to see the food a whole lot, but I do have some food uh, pics to uh, video in there. <laughs> but um, yeah, they made the best coffee all around, hands down. Normally I only drink one cup of coffee if I'm out at a restaurant. Um, I drank four cups, and <laughs> I usually don't do that. <laughs> so, um, yeah, um, I hope you enjoy the video. It'll be, it'll be a good one. Okay, so we are at Waffle House. Um, looking here at the coffee cup here. Already one down. And... Um, they make the best coffee all around, hands down. And it is hot. They fill it up to the top. I mean, just some delicious, delicious coffee. Okay, so um, this is the waffle that I am eating. I um, had to add my butter and my syrup on there. Um, the waffle was cooked perfect for me. Um, a little bit of brown. Um, it wasn't too hard. It wasn't too crispy. It was um, soft. It was chewy. Um, my mother-in-law likes it a little crispy, so she didn't, she got hers, um, like that. And my wife can't have the waffles because of her, um, uh, celiac disease, so she couldn't eat that. And, um, it, there wasn't too many people in there. Um, just one other couple at the bar eating, and somebody else came in a little bit later on, and the way the server was um, talking to us pretty much the whole time, just about. <laughs> but um, he did a good job, and a um, good tip was well-deserved, so I um, can't complain about that. Um, like I said, it, it, it was a good job. Um, the food, on the other hand, some of it was okay, and uh, some of it wasn't. Um, again, the coffee, um, four cups of coffee. I hardly ever drink four cups of coffee. And, um, it was, the coffee was delicious. With some, uh, a little bit of sugar and two creams, makes everything just right. Just 
just about finished with the waffle there. Um, I mean, that was a good waffle. I mean, normally I don't eat everything. Or I, normally I would take the waffle home and eat it a little bit later on. But I was hungry that night. <laughs> so it was well worth it. You know, it's amazing that um, those cooks, Waffle House line cooks, can um, remember everything that those servers call in to them. There is no way that I could work at a Waffle House as a server. Because <laughs> I'm not, my memory is uh, not that good um, like that. So, um, hats off to them. They, um, sometimes they get it wrong. Most of the time they get it right, though. Um, I mean, and this was an older gentleman. I believe he might have been the manager, but um, again, he did a good job. Uh, got the food out quickly, so they, I mean, Waffle House always did um, get foods out quick. And so, um, Just about finished with the waffle there. And gonna move on over to the main dish. You can see I'm in uh, I'm enjoying myself. I think everybody was enjoying themselves. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm eating, now I'm on to the hash browns. And um, the hash browns was a little too crispy for my liking. I, was, I know some people like crispy hash browns, but I don't. Um, they were golden, they were brown, they were just a little bit overcooked. I did have to add salt to them, um, but that's a given with the hash browns. Um, but it was okay. I do, and I did enjoy it. For the hash bread, I mean, for the um, waffles, you know, I would give that one a, um, I would give it a five out of five, seriously, for the waffles. And for the hash browns, just because it was overcooked and too, a little too crispy for my take, for my liking, I'm going to give it a three and a half out of five for the hash browns. And see me having a sip of that great coffee there. And now I'm on to the um, eggs. Um, I ordered the eggs sunny side up, as you saw in the um, beginning of the video. They were a little overcooked um, for being sunny side up. I like them a little bit more runny than that. Um, the yolk was a little hard, but I mean, I still ate it. Um, I added a little bit of pepper to the eggs for flavor. Um, but it made it, made it worth it. Um, so normally they do the, normally they get my eggs right. And the toast was spot on, buttery flavor, buttery taste. The toast was good. I enjoyed that toast. Um, for the um, eggs, since they were a little bit overcooked, and not like I um, had requested as sunny side up, I'm going to give that a three and a half out of five. So overall, for the Waffle House All Star Breakfast, I'm going to give it a four out of five. Thanks a lot for watching. I hope you all have a great day and thanks for your support and your votes on which video to play. You have a good one.